Hi guys, it's me and today this is going to be a songs I regret hearing video. These are songs that I personally just did not enjoy enjoy for like certain reason, certain reasons, like um, either they were overplayed or some of them I just they made me cry and I didn't think they were worth hearing. And overall, this is just my complete personal opinion. So if some of you guys like these songs, that's totally fine. Fine, we all have different tastes in like music. Like some of us like slow music or medium music. Music, then that's totally fine. Fine, and um, just so you guys know, I'm not trying to bash any of the artists that sing these songs. Um, these are some that I just personally don't like that much, but I love most of the artists I have on here. Almost most of the artists, actually. I love, um, like, almost most of the artists I have on here. It's just these songs I just didn't like. Okay, so I'm going to get started. So the first one is Call Me Maybe by Carly Rae Jepsen. The reason I... The reason I don't like that song is because it is the most overplayed song on this planet. Actually, it was overplayed for, like, probably two years, and I am completely sick of it. And every time it comes on the radio, it makes me want to tear my hair out. And I bet that's how a lot of you guys feel feel with um, certain songs. And that's the thing I don't like about the radio. Sometimes they'll play, like, my favorite artists, like, over and over again. And then, or again, which drives you crazy. Crazy, and it drives me crazy, too. Too, when they play my favorite artist over and over again. Again, it just makes them people not like them anymore. Okay, so number two would have to be the next song that I ha have is "Drop in the Ocean" by Michelle Branch. It's just way too slow for me, and I just don't think it's um, that good. Good just because it's way too slow. And like I said, I'm more of an in-between medium and fast song person. I just don't like songs that are way too slow because they kind of make me feel bored. I don't know. The next one would have to be, and the one that I can't stand, and I mentioned this in my True Truths and a Lie tag, and if you're into, my tag is that Miley, is Wrecking Ball my Miley Cyrus. I hate Miley Cyrus. I bet a lot of you guys know that I hate Miley Cyrus. The reason I, and, then, and the reason I don't like that song, Wrecking Ball, is because it is weird. And I just hate my the series, and I um, the reason I don't like Miley Cyrus is because she's creepy. I cannot stand her. The next one would have to be the Climb by Miley Cyrus. It was played in my mom's. It was played in someone's car, and it was like, uh, I was like, oh no, I hate this song. I heard it once before, and it was just terrible. I think it was. I thought it was way too slow, and it made no sense of hearing at all. Okay, so the next one is one called Numbers by Soft Cell. Oh, and I used to, and I mentioned this in my CD collection, is that I used to love Soft Cell until I overplayed them. And now I just don't like them anymore. More in the Soul Inside, I just didn't think um, was worth hearing. I don't know, it was just a weird song. Um, and Soft Cell, is, and that band is really weird. Weird, and it's just a really weird song. Okay, so, oh, whoops, I skipped one. The first, the next one, I, oops, I skipped a couple, I'm sorry. Um, ver the next one is Hurt by Christina Aguilera. I'm sorry, I skipped a few. I even I'm starting over, and the reason I don't like Hurt by Christina Aguilera is because it's just way too sad. I saw the music video, and it made me burst into tears. It was a big tearjerker. And by the way, if you guys want any songs that are tearjerkers, let me know in the comments below. Well, I don't really have any songs that are tearjerkers, but any requests, just let me know. That song was just a tearjerker for me. I watched the music video, and it just made me burst into tears because I made me feel sorry. For, it didn't make me make me feel sorry because I felt bad for Christina Aguilera. It was cute watching her childhood and then watching her ignore her father. It just made me cry and then her getting a note that he passed away. It just made me cry. The next one would have to be Numbers by Soft Cell. It was a weird song and let me tell you, Soft Cell is a weird band from the 80s. I used to really like them when I was in middle school and then now I don't like them anymore because I overplayed them. And then and the next one is Soul Inside by Soft Cell. I don't know. It's just, that's another weird song that doesn't make any sense to me. 
to me, which is weird. The next one would have to be Soda Pop by Britney Spears. The reason I don't like um, Soda Pop, well, I don't like Britney Spears that much anymore, but I mean, I don't hate her. I liked her when I was a kid, but then they started overplaying her so much on the radio. So when I was like about 10 or something, I don't know. Um, actually, I got into Britney Spears when I was a kid. I think about age 9 I got into her, and then they started overplaying her, and then I got tired of hearing her, and I'm like, oh, no. Oops, I did it again. It's because, um, the reason I don't like Oops, I did it again is the same reason as the other song. Overplayed too much on the radio. Radio. It's just like the weird, we're, it's just like the most, um, It's just the most annoying song. The next one is, um, I don't like is 15 by Taylor Swift. Swift. I don't know. Just, I just, that song just didn't make sense to me. And I just didn't think it was that good. It was a little bit too slow for me. The next one is the most obnoxious song on this planet that I hate and is Bird is the Word by Trash Man. And I bet a lot of you guys know that song, and I bet mo a lot of people hate it because it's like the most obnoxious song ever. Ever. It just has pretty much the same line lines over and over again. It's just the most annoying song ever. The next one is Thinking About You. Um, the reason I, by Britney Spears. The next one I did, the reason why I didn't like Thinking About You by Britney Spears is because I don't, no, I didn't think the lyrics were put together very well. I like songs that have lyrics that are put together well, because then they make more sense to me. But, um, me, but even though Ta I do think Taylor Swift puts lyrics together, just 15 wasn't my favorite. But, um, thinking about you just was, you, I just didn't think that it was put together well. I like songs that are put together well, just because I think they give more of a meaning than songs that aren't put together well. Okay, so those were my songs I regret hearing. That was my songs I regret hearing video. Wow, that went by quick. And I hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you in a songs I've heard so many times and still love video next. Bye!